All praises to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shai, Bashim, Kadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of that great millstone. And shalom to the brethren. I have this nuclear arsenal uh, by country chart list pulled up that lists the hierarchy um, from the top nuclear arsenal to, to um, I should say, the top 10 nuclear arsenals on the planet. All right. And this is to show you that the Most High has now endowed the other nations with um, the equalizer, which are these nuclear missiles. It only takes a few of them to devastate and completely fucking destroy a small landmass. I mean, uh, Slakia, a, a larger landmass. All right. It was stated by one of the Iranian officials, uh, military officials, about going back about six years ago, that with one of with one of their uh, thermonuclear missiles, you know, how, however many warheads that is, can destroy. A landmass the size of Texas or France. All right. So just with, if you equate out the size of Texas in comparison to to all of U.S., only you know it's it ain't no fifty Texases. So only a few of these missiles will fucking completely destroy a massive landmass, man. And that's exactly what is is in fear the nations are in fear of in what's known as mutually assured destruction. And these weapons are the the weapons of the most high's indignation as read in the scriptures, man. All right. This is uh cap this off. It says which countries have nuclear weapons? Russia. All right, and you see that. You see how much that is. U.S. All right, China, France, U.K., Pakistan, India, Israel, North Korea. All right. So, America's fucked. And uh, really going into this current... Um, you know, conflict that America has found itself in with now giving aid to Ukraine have um, made themselves the uh, um, the opponent of Russia. The, the Russians already told motherfuckers that whoever gives aid to Ukraine in any way all right, has any involvement in this thing is fucking... Um, is going against Russia. All right. So this this thing is going to turn nuclear. And it shows you right here. Uh, Russia has a far superior n nuclear arsenal than America. And it's all biblical. Because at one point, America was the only fucking... One of the only nations that had these things. And had the, the balls to drop them. It says the top military leader... Says China's hypersonic missile test went around the world. China's test of a, of a hypersonic missile over the summer went around the world. The second most senior U.S. general said in an interview released Tuesday, shedding new details on the test, a warning that China might one day be able to launch a surprise nuclear attack on the U.S. They launched a long range missile. General John Hyden, the outgoing vice chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, told CBS News, who went around the world, dropped off a hypersonic glide vehicle that glided all the way back to China that impacted a target in China. When asked if a missile hit the target, Hyden said, said close enough. All right. This is Hyden. Previously called the pace 
at which China's military is developing capabilities stunning, warned that one day they could have the capability to launch a surprise nuclear attack on the U.S. Why are they building all of this capability, Haydn said. They look for the first use weapon. They they look like a first use weapon. That's what those weapons look like to me. All right. Dropping down to the last paragraph, which says, As China and Russia are developing their own versions of hypersonic missiles, the Pentagon has made developing hypersonic missiles one of its top priorities. A U.S. hypersonic missile test failed last month, but the Pentagon insists it remains on track to deliver offensive hypersonic weapons in the early 2020s. All right. So just showed you right there China just successfully tested hypersonic missiles all right that actually f- fucking flew around the earth and then hit its target so and then America's failed so this was um by the the admission of one of the top generals in the US military all right he told you from his own fucking mouth that China's hypersonic nuclear arsenal is superior to that. And Russia is superior to that of the U.S. All right. So in that equalizer, the, the thermonuclear missiles is, uh, is being fucking uh, beefed up in these other nations. And it's straight up scriptural going uh, straight back to the prophecy, um, the biblical prophecies, man. All right. There's a prophetic timeline for the things that were going to go down. All right. Before the return of Yahweh Shai, who the world England calls uh, Jesus Christ. And when when he returns uh, it's going to be simultaneous with th- uh, thermonuclear fucking uh, oblivion throughout the world all right and a few a few spots fucking that'll get that'll get spared for the most part part that mad is about to fucking flourish throughout this place man all right cuz it's the most high's will these are the weapons of his nation He's putting it in the minds, as it's written in the scriptures, the um, the smith that blew the coal and the fire. He's working in the minds of those, um, the motherfuckers who are developing these weapons. And it also goes into the scriptures how it says that a sword is being furbished. Um, it's being sharpened so that it may slaughter. All right. These, the... The destruction capacity of these weapons is being um, is being uh, uh, advanced. You know the technology of these weapons are being advanced. All right, this is all the will of the heavenly Father. It says in Joel three and ten, beat your plowshares into swords and your pruning hooks into spears. Let the weak say, I am strong. All right. So we're in the time of the fulfillment of biblical prophecy. All right. Where now you have China, Russia, but primarily going into this current conflict, you have Russia fucking um, with the pretty much with the arsenal, with the... um, artillery thermonuclear to fucking wipe this place off the map with no problem alright and that's exactly what's gonna happen and let's get it correct this place is gonna get fucking pelted with 200 million warheads however many missiles that is this place they're gonna let them fly on this place man not just Russia but that whole that whole uh, uh, clip 60, 6200 they're gonna let that whole clip fly 
on Babylon most I willing. But a hey, in in one way or another two hundred million missiles two hundred thousand thousand will be the fate of, of the great Babylon. Alright? So with that all praise to Yah Bashim Yahushai Bashim Kadash Shalom.